up, sports fans? Mandy back, speaking my sports talk. All right, check it out, man. Got a new special guest. That's right. I'm back with it. The You Idiot segment. And today's special guest is all of it. Lloyd Mayweather. You idiot. We'll start this off with Floyd Mayweather. And it's basically the Terrence Crawford versus Lomachenko situation. And, you know, we hear a lot of fans from channel to channel talk a lot of foolery about these two guys. And I want to start off by saying this. When it comes to the best in boxing, there's three names mentioned. Terrence Crawford, Cielo Lomachenko, and Canelo Alvarez. And that there is for a reason. Because Floyd Mayweather, they're all close. And there's reasons for them to be close. Floyd Mayweather, you idiot. So when you sit here and you say that, you know, Lomachenko's nowhere close to Terrence Crawford, not in a million years. And you say this idiotic stuff, Floyd Mayweather. Then what are you basing that on? This is what I, you know, this, this is where I'm interested in. What, what are you actually basing that on? Because we can't go fight for fight. Terrence Crawford has double the But we could consider the last 15 fight for Terrence Crawford because that is all the goes into my career. It literally started, you know, months apart considering the last 15 fights. Lomachenko started in 2013, just months before Terrence Crawford was hitting his fight to make 15 in 2014, so months apart. And so when we compare the last 15 fights, the resumes are comparable, extremely comparable, Floyd Mayweather. You idiot. That's number one. Number two, why are you trying to throw shade over there on top rank and mention and talk about Terrence Crawford and what he should be as a star? Then I'm going to change your name for a second and call you Floyd Heyman or maybe Al Mayweather. Either way, you want to think about it. Because it's you and Al Heyman that, in my opinion, has even more to do with Terrence Crawford not being the star he should be. You idiot. And you know why I say that, Floyd Mayweather? Well, let me see. If you, Floyd Heyman, had sent over the Sean Porters, the Keith Thurmans, the Danny Garcias, the Errol Spences to fight him, then we don't know what could have happened. Now, personally, I think that Terry Crawford beats everyone on the PBC side except my guy, Errol Spence. Now, Errol Spence is a different animal. Errol Spence is a fight that I would actually like to see Terrence Crawford engage in because I don't think that he can beat Errol Spence. You know, I kind of went back and then I went forth with it. You know, I've seen these guys' performances and I'm back with my guy Spence, very slightly. But it's because of you, Floyd Heyman, you idiot. It's because of you that Terrence Crawford it's not as big as he should be because had he beaten those guys, maybe if Terrence Crawford was sitting with two belts, you know, maybe if he was sitting with three belts, you know, maybe you would have some validity to your argument, <clears throat> especially since he's already cleaned out 144 belt undisputed. Only a handful of guys has done that in the history of boxing. So already there's an accomplishment that makes you an idiot putting, uh, you know, you're just an idiot, okay? That's an accomplishment. But once he got to 147, he somewhat plateaued. And it's not because of top rank. It's because of you, Floyd Heyman. You idiot. See, you and Al Heyman, Floyd Mayweather, you guys did what they call, how did they say it in the media? Froze out Terrence Crawford. You guys, at one point, didn't even want to acknowledge WBO belt as if it was an actual belt, although it had been recognized by the other sanctioning bodies, which means it's a recognized belt, Floyd Mayweather. You idiot. You guys tried to act like that wasn't even a belt at all. You guys did everything in your power to prevent Terrence Crawford from being that guy he should be. So don't sit there and throw stones if you're living in a glass house, Floyd Mayweather. You idiot. Because you had every 
bit to do with it, if not more than Bob Aaron, of Terrence Crawford not being where he's supposed to be. And see, you're so narcissistic, Floyd Mayweather, and your partner, Al Haley. We all know what he is. But the combination of your narcissism and him blocking fights the way he do, Terrence Crawford never really had a chance, did he? Because you, Floyd Mayweather, are so narcissistic, you idiot, that you don't even want any of those guys over on the PBC side to shine more than you. Could have a lot to do with why Errol Spence is told not to take the fight. Not to take the fight. Errol Spence was to go four belt undisputed. Well, that's something that the great Floyd Mayweather never did. You narcissistic fuck you. And you got a lot to do with this. And you want to talk about Lomachenko's nowhere close to not in a million years. Well, let me tell you something else, Floyd Mayweather, you idiot. Lomachenko is about to fight Teofimo Lopez, which I personally think Teofimo Lopez is going to knock Lomachenko the fuck out in the seventh round. But with that being said, he's fighting a guy who could potentially beat him. That's the key. He's fighting a guy that could potentially beat him. Well, we'll never even get that chance to see if Crawford can fight a guy that could potentially beat him because you have all of those guys on your side, Floyd Mayweather, you idiot. And you will not allow those guys to fight Terrence Crawford, Floyd Mayweather, you idiot. So when you sit up here and you say, not by a million years, why don't you say not by a million years because... I won't allow certain things to happen. And I don't agree with Terrence Crawford being better than Lomachenko in any level. Not by a million seconds, you will eat. These guys are comparable. And most of the fans, most of the com columnists, most of the boxing analysts, I think they agree. It's the reason that everyone talks about these three guys at one, two, or three. Put them where you want, Canelo Alvarez. Terrence Crawford, and Lomachenko. And if you, Floyd Mayweather, would allow Terrence Crawford to continue his journey, you idiot, then maybe, maybe you would have some validity. But as long as Terrence Crawford is not accomplishing at 147, as long as Terrence Crawford is not getting the fights that he needs to get, which you control, you idiot, then your statement is absolutely ridiculous. And you deserve to be the special guest of this episode of You Idiot, Floyd Mayweather. Well, guys, that's all I got. Floyd Mayweather's definitely an idiot today. You guys know how always in this thing. For the love of sports, let's talk about it. Peace.